get dough I can't get no sleep, please make my life more simple Miles inside these shoes so I don't stomp, I tiptoe Fell a thousand times and still I roll no limp though But I wouldn't trade a thing for what I have I go hard, do what I need to make it last They say the good die young, I hope I'm bad Cheers to my past, I'm doing great now Just in case they ask, in the booth and I lay it down I might take a nap, and they thought I was playing around Now what's up like my tag? Alright, welcome back to the channel So I literally just came back from, from a 350 mile road trip. I was just picking up the sweet uh, paddle board. I've been on the marketplace for quite a long time uh, trying to put this uh, package together. So as you can see behind me, this is the Yakima overhead HD rack. I've also been uh, shopping around for that for the last several months. I wanted to put this together before summer started. Can hit up the water and do some fishing and can also take the family and do some kayaking and paddle boarding as well because we do a lot of road trips over the summer to a lot of cool places like Door County for example and it's uh, one of the best places to paddle board or kayak. I just I picked this thing up uh, off of Facebook Marketplace and I was actually, actually only paid half of what it really cost brand new. Uh, Facebook Marketplace is a great place to uh, find used equipment and I also picked up this board it was also half the price of what the brand new one would cost you so it's just I recommend that if you're gonna go shopping for some of the anything that you need I uh, check that out first because Craigslist a lot of times it's a hit or miss but Facebook's got a lot of good stuff on there all right so now we're gonna go over the installation of the bed rack system if you ordered uh, the full bed rack then you shouldn't have an issue with getting the bed rails but since I bought my used I called diamond bag directly and they were able to ship me just uh, the rail system as you can see I had to loosen up all the screws since it came uh, assembled from a previous owner make sure you bring the manual with you for the installation instructions so as you can see we decided to use the chalk line for this you know, it made it easier to line up the front and back rails and we use it as a reference and it's not just not for the exact measurements but just as a reference as you can see I still ended up uh, using tape to put some hash marks so this way it could be more exact uh, with the measurements then we lined up all the rails to make sure they're all they all look even and double and triple checked the measurements with the rulers for the front and back then as you can see you use a center punch and then you drill your pilot hole which is not shown but then you use the bigger bit to finish off your drilling the holes and then you install your the bed rails and uh, I used the screw gun just to speed up the process because there was a rain big thunderstorm coming in just make sure you're not over tightening these uh, at the end so you're not stripping the bolts and before you put these end caps on make sure you don't put the bolts in just put the end cap and then put the the bolts in and then you slide in the bolts for the overhead rack system and make sure you're cutting uh, rubber pieces to the correct length and then you install the towers as you can see start pouring and uh, we kind of had to rush this process a little more and this is pretty much it just to make sure that you're double checking and triple checking your measurements and make sure everything lines up evenly so the only thing that I noticed that wasn't even was when I installed everything and uh, front and the back were just off by a couple of inches I'm not sure why that happened the rack itself works perfectly and everything looks even and lined up so I hope you all enjoyed this video I hope uh, there's enough information in here that I didn't miss anything I know it's a uh, kind of a hard video to shoot because this took several days to do um, so if you got any questions about the installation of this or or anything else in general about about this rack or the diamond back cover you can always hit us up in the comments below or you can also hit us up on uh, Instagram at to the core actual to the core media officer 78 and uh, we'd really appreciate it if you give us a thumbs up if you'd subscribe to the channel and share with everybody else seems like our diamond back cover is probably one of our top videos that we shot in the past year so Hopefully this one will get a lot of likes as well. And we'll see you on the next one.